In this video, we will go over 20 mechanical comprehension questions for the ASVAB test. If you learn the concepts, you can answer correctly. Let's get started. Number 1. The force that resists the relative motion of two surfaces in contact is known as a. Normal reaction, b. Drag, c. Friction, or d. Gravity. The correct answer is letter C. Friction. This is because friction is the force that opposes the motion of one solid object over another. There are mainly four types of friction, static friction, sliding friction, rolling friction, and fluid friction. Number 2. A force that pushes materials together is known as A. Effort, B. Compression, C, resistance, or D, compound. The correct answer is letter, B, compression. Compression is the application of balanced inward forces to different points on a material or structure, that is, forces with no net sum or torque directed so as to reduce its size in one or more directions. Number 3. A fighter plane has a mass of 25,000 kilograms. What is the thrust if the plane accelerates at 2.5 meter per second squared? A. 10,000 newtons. B. 31,250 newtons. C. 62,500 newtons. D. 125,000 newtons. The correct answer is letter C. 62,500 newtons. The formula used is force is equals to mass times acceleration. Number 4. A stable situation in which net force is equal to zero is? A. Resultant, B. Equilibrium, C. Torque, or D. Inertia. The correct answer is letter, B. Equilibrium. Equilibrium is a state in which opposing forces or actions are balanced so that one is not stronger or greater than the other. When the object is in equilibrium, it does not move. Number 5. Tension is measured in? A. Watt, B. Newton, C. Ampere, or D. Kilowatt hour. The correct answer is letter, B. Newton. This is because tension is a force and the unit of force is Newton. Number 6. The rate at which velocity changes is? A. Acceleration, B. Velocity, C. Force, or D. Momentum. The correct answer is letter, A. Acceleration. The rate of change in velocity over time is called acceleration. Number 7. A change in the position of a particle in a fixed direction is known as a. Distance, b. Length, c. Displacement, or d. Speed. The correct answer is letter c. Displacement. Displacement is defined as the change in position of an object. It is a vector quantity and has a direction and magnitude. Number 8. Which one of the following is not a vector quantity? A. Force, B. Torque, C. Work, or D. Acceleration. The correct answer is letter, C. Work. Work is the energy transferred to or from an object via the application of force along a displacement. Work is the scalar multiple of force and displacement. So, work is a scalar quantity. Number 9. Blank energy is the potential energy stored in the nucleus of an atom, A. Nuclear, B. Solar, C. Atomic, or D. Internal energy. The correct answer is letter, A. Nuclear. Nuclear energy is the energy in the nucleus, or core, of an atom. Atoms are tiny units that make up all matter in the universe, and energy is what holds the nucleus together. There is a huge amount of energy in an atom's dense nucleus. Number 10. 
energy in moving electrons through the conductor is a. Potential energy, b. Electrical energy, c. Kinetic energy, or d. Internal energy. The correct answer is letter b. Electrical energy. This is because electrical energy is the power an atom's charged particles have to cause an action or move an object. The movement of electrons from one atom to another is what results in electrical energy. Number 11. What is the unit of energy? A. Joule, B. Watt, C. Newton, or D. Ampere. The correct answer is letter A. Joule. The joule, a unit of work or energy in the international system of units, is equal to the work done by the force of one newton acting through one meter. Number 12. What measures how much force is applied to an object in order to rotate it? A. Torque. B. Friction. C. Pressure. Or D. Vector. The correct answer is letter A. Torque. Torque is a measure of the force that can cause an object to rotate about an axis. Just as force is what causes an object to accelerate in linear kinematics, torque is what causes an object to acquire angular acceleration. Number 13. Which is the attractive force between objects in space? A. Electric force. B. Friction. C. Magnetic force. Or D. Gravity. The correct answer is letter D. Gravity. Gravity is the attractive force between objects in space. Number 14. In a lever, the distance from the force to the fulcrum is the A. Effort arm, B. Load arm, C. Fulcrum, or D. Pivot. The correct answer is letter A. Effort arm. This is because levers are machines used to increase force. We call them simple machines because they have only two parts, the handle and the fulcrum. The handle or bar of the lever is called the arm, it's the part that you push or pull on. The fulcrum is the point on which the lever turns or balances. Number 15. Pressure is equal to the force acting over a. A distance b. A period of time, c. Unit volume, or d. Unit area. The correct answer is letter, d. Unit area. Pressure is the force applied perpendicular to the surface of an object per unit area over which that force is distributed. Number 16. The moisture that forms on the inside of a window on a cold day is called? a. Condensation, b distillation, C, evaporation, or D, tarnation. The correct answer is letter, A, condensation. This is because condensation is the change of the state of matter from the gas phase into the liquid phase and is the reverse of vaporization. Number 17. In which of these temperature scales is absolute zero shown at zero? A, Fahrenheit, B, Celsius, C, Kelvin, or D, none of the above. The correct answer is letter, C, Kelvin. The thermodynamic Kelvin scale of temperature used in SI has its origin or zero point at absolute zero. Number 18. A force is applied at one end of a hydraulic jack. The area at the other end of the jack is five times the area where James is applying the force. How much larger is the exerted force than what James is applying? A. Twice as large. B. Half as large. C. One-fifth as large. Or D. Five times as large. The correct answer is letter. D. Five times as large. Number 19. The property of attraction of some metals is a. Electricity, b. Magnetism, c. Inertia, or d. Metallic property. The correct answer is letter, b. Magnetism. Magnetism is the force exerted by magnets when they attract or repel each other.
Magnetism is caused by the motion of electric charges. Some metals show this magnetic property. Number 20. The measure of the quantity of matter in an object is its a. Mass, b. Force, c. Weight, or d. Density. The correct answer is letter a. Mass. This is because mass is the amount of matter in any solid object or in any volume of liquid or gas. Download the ASFOB tutoring app for iOS or Android for more practice.